Hey guys, we're going to do a quick 15 minute core workout today. Um, grab a mat and maybe a kettlebell or something that you can use for a weighted object for a couple of the things. Um, I really love to focus on my core. Um, you do work core if you're lifting weights, when you do deadlifts, and you do um, squats, anything that your whole body is engaged, you're also working your core. So what's nice though is sometimes is just to be able to focus on that core. Um, personally, I love it. Um, there's just something about strengthening it and knowing that I'm working it that makes me feel good. Um, it holds up our whole body, right? It supports our back and everything else, so it's such a great body part to strengthen. Um, I notice that a lot of clients, they a lot of times have a weak core, um, a weak lower back area, so when they first start training, it really takes us some time to strengthen that area. So um, go ahead and get ready, grab a yoga mat or something to sit on, and let's do some core exercises, okay? We're gonna start out right now. Turn on your watches too if you are wearing a watch. Um, with the newer one, um, if you've done some of my videos, but you're gonna sit with your feet together. Can you guys see my legs? We're gonna go ahead and lay back. Let's keep down a little bit more on the mat so you can see all of me. We're gonna lay back and we're gonna do a sit up like this and then down. Good job. So nice outside today where I'm at. Hopefully your weather's nice where you're at. It's starting to get warmer here. Stay with me. One more. Good. Good job. Felt really good, huh? Stretch out a little bit. Pull those shoulders back. Whew. We're going to do some bicycle crunches next. So get ready and get in position. We're going to go opposites, okay? So it's going to be opposite knee to opposite elbow. Keep that core tight. Come on, come on. And good. Woo! Oh, feeling good, right? Feeling good, guys? We're gonna go back to that first one. So back into position, feet together, sit up nice and tall. We're gonna go ahead and lay back. And we're gonna go ahead and come up. Definitely get harder after doing those bicycle crunches. Try and keep those legs down. I know mine wanna pop up. Good job. Whew. How are we doing out there? Are we good? Okay, let's go ahead. We're gonna go back to that bicycle crunch position. Whew. Got my heart rate going. So, okay, back. We're gonna lay back down again. Opposite elbow to opposite knee. Ready? Let's go. Core's tight. And rest. Whew. One more set of these. One and more of each. We'll get back into position. We'll go ahead and take a breather for just a second. Whew. Just feel that stretch. Hopefully you're doing this workout in conjunction with one of my other workouts or with a good run or a good hike. Uh, partner it with something else you're doing in your day. If this is all you have time for today, that's okay. It's better than nothing at all, right? Okay. Ready? I'll lay back down. And up. So the 
butterfly crunch. Butterflies and bicycles. I like it, right? Summertime. Come on. There's three more. One more. Good job. Whew. Those got my heart rate up. We're going to go back to that bicycle crunch next. Back into position. We'll rest here for just about 20 seconds. Good job. How are we doing out there? Okay. Go ahead, lay down. Hands behind your head. Ready? Let's go. Like your pedal on a bike. And rest. Whew. Good job. All right, we're gonna go ahead. You can either use a weight here or no weight at all. We're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna grab a kettlebell and we're gonna do some Russian twists. So the key to these is really focusing when we go down to each side. We're keeping that core tight, our weights in our core. Feet are gonna be up off the ground, okay? And we wanna draw that belly button to your spine, okay? You don't want your weight in your feet, you want it into your core, okay? Ready? And let's go. Side to side. Come on, 21, 21, come on, 22, 22, we're going to 30. Perfect. Whew. Go ahead and come on down to a rest. Sit up nice and tall. Whew. If you're sitting outside like me, soak in that beautiful sunshine. <sighs> get your heart rate up which is great great little core exercise I love doing Russian twists I love working my obliques it's probably one muscle group I work one of the most when I do core we're going to do another set catch your breath go ahead and grab that weight if you're using a weight if you're doing no weight just really concentrate on that side to side movement okay ready and let's go Feet are up. Come on, keep it up. Come on, 10 more. Come on, eight, nine, and 10. Good job. We have one more set of these guys. Whew. If you're using a weight like me, you definitely feel it in your arms. My arms right now are tight from lifting. So I did arms this morning. So this is my second workout of the day. Whew. Got one more set of these. You guys got this. Are we ready? Ready out there? Okay, let's pick it up and grab it again. Back into position. Okay, let's go. Come on. Stay with me, halfway. Five more. Ah, you want to step it off to the side. Done with that. 
crazy we're already 10 minutes in, huh? Time flies when you're having fun. We're gonna go ahead and get into a reverse crunch position so you guys can see me good. Whew. Catch your breath for just a minute. Let's let that heart rate come down a little bit. Okay, are we ready? So we're gonna lean back. We're gonna go out and in, out and in. You can put your hands down behind you if you need to for balance, so more like this, but make sure your weight is in your core again and not in your hands, okay? I like to put mine here for balance. Come on, five more. And 20, good. Whew. Come on up and take a breath. Great job. A couple more sets of these. Hopefully you guys have done some of my other videos. If not, check them out. I think we have about 12 listed right now um, from Dedicated Strength in Indio, California. So definitely check out some of the other videos if this is your first one you're doing with me, okay? Another set of these, are we ready? Okay, let's go. Concentrate on that core, keep it tight. Halfway. Come on. Two more. And 20. Good. Catch your breath. Are we ready? Okay, let's go. Last set. Halfway. And 20, good. Okay, come on up. We're gonna get into a plank position next. We're gonna do those shoulder tap planks. One of my favorites. I have a few favorites, I guess, when it comes to core. But I really love that it gives you some shoulder and arm strength, also working your stability and your core, okay? So we're gonna be up in plank position. Balance, booties down. We don't want a high booty, no stink bugs. We want it flat, okay? And then tap your shoulders. Let's go, let's go. Come on, come on. Come on. Five more. so bad, right? Just feel nice and strong. I actually love that feeling. When I started my journey about seven years ago, I hated working out. I wouldn't walk to the mailbox. <laughs> Seriously. And um, lost my dad to cancer. And during that time, I decided to start working out for the first time in my life. I'm 40 now, just so you know, age-wise where I was at. And decided that that was going to be my therapy. Signed up for a 5K in San Diego. Never doing a 5K in my life. Even my husband thought I was crazy. But it propelled me to want to do more. And I noticed that when I was working out, I felt better. It helped me mentally deal with all of the sickness that my dad was going through. And I realized that if he was sick and he couldn't do this kind of stuff, I could. And I could do it for him. So that was the start. And I never stopped after that. And it's amazing how much better you feel when you have some strength behind you. Let's go ahead and do another set. Back in position. Ready, core is tight. Let's go. Okay, are we ready? Let's go. Almost there. Just about done. Finish up this last set and do some stretches, okay? Catch your breath. Oh, stretch for a minute. 
get a drink if you need a drink. We're almost done. Great job. Okay, last set. We ready for this? Back in position and start. Come on, come on. down to the ground, stretch a little bit, Whew. wiggle those legs, oh, let's go ahead and grab those ankles, hold it, hold it, feel that stretch through your hamstrings, you know mine are tight from all my running this week. Come up nice and slow, nice and slow. Let's bring those feet back in like we did with our butterfly crunches earlier. Grab your toes, sit up nice and tall. Oh. Pull your shoulders down away from your ears. Push down on your knees to where they're closer to the ground. And just relax for a minute. Good job. Good job out there. So glad you joined me today. We'll be posting some more videos this week, a couple longer ones. We did just do a 30 minute workout a few days ago. So that's a great one to check out too. And definitely check out TC1 Gel. They're one of my main sponsors. Been with them for four years. Love their products. Great for core work. Great for being able to raise your heart rate. It's a topical thermogenic. So check them out too. Okay. Thanks guys. Thanks for joining me today. Have a great day. Bye.